Today we are remembering the life of Maxine Drinkwater Simmons. She was 87 years old. The Camden native played on in the All-American Girls Professional Baseball League, the inspiration for the movie A League of Their Own. The league folded after her rookie year, but Simmons played stayed rather active in baseball by coaching boys teams. The Portland Sea Dogs paying their condolences and the team honored her at a game in 2017. In 2005, she was inducted into the Maine Baseball Hall of Fame. Caroline Cornish tells us about why that induction was historic. And I don't mind being called one of the guys. After all, it's as a baseball happened. player, Maxine That's Drinkwater Simmons has been one of the guys all her life. Followed the boys around. I guess you'd say I was a tomboy. Now she joins her newest boys club as the first woman in Maine's Baseball Hall of Fame. It's kind of odd <laughs> what's happening. Can never believe this would have happened. Odd to Simmons because she hung up her spikes 51 years ago. In 1954, she left her hometown of Camden to play for the South Bend Blue Sox in the Girls Professional Baseball League. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first game of the All American Girls Baseball League the South Bend Blue Sox against your own Rockford Peaches. The league was made famous by the 1992 movie, A League of Their Own. Simmons' mother remembers taking her to the tryouts. And she was so happy to get in there that year, and she did real well. Simmons was only able to play professional ball for one season before the women's league folded. But unlike a lot of other rookies, she did get into a number of games, where she was known as a good fielder. I'd like to be playing now, but... My legs don't work as well as they did. <laughs> After the movie came out, the National Baseball Hall of Fame inducted the girls' league players. But the chair of Maine's Hall, Sonny Noel, just learned about Simmons this year. He brought her name before the board. I said, was there anybody in this room that's inducted into the Hall of Fame in Cooperstown? And I looked around in 10, they said, no. And I said, well, she is. <laughs> Simmons has stayed close to baseball. She used to coach boys' teams, and she still gets autograph requests. I don't know, I just never thought when I, I played that it would be anything like this. With this honor, she'll always be one of the guys. In Portland, Caroline Cornish, News Center. She was a non-athlete. She certainly paved the way. Mm -hmm. that